day one. Hello there, YouTube. So, um, I feel like I should clarify a few things. Um, well, anyway, this is our, you know, next Let's Play for 60 Seconds. And the family's, d well, most of the family's dead, so that sucks. That's the putting water, water means we know it's time for that. Okay, okay. So, anyway, what I was trying to say before is basically, um, I've been having some issues lately, um, with recording, as you all know, but here's the thing, I found a solution for that, but by finding a solution, I found yet another problem, um, so I'm, I have downloaded a free trial for Sony Vegas 13. And I finally figured out how to balance the sound audio of the game and my voice. And I practiced that with my Sonic Adventure videos. So I know I can do it. I know exactly at what uh, amount of audio I want the game to be. So you can still hear the game and you can hear my voice. Because Jay from the Cub Scouts can do it. Game Grumps does it like they find a way to balance the game audio with their voice and I figured out how to do it but here's the thing freaking Sony Vegas 13 costs $600 if I edit a video with Sony Vegas it adds a stupid effing Sony Vegas um, watermark and I don't want that so I don't know what to do because, you know, I need my money for other things. I, you know, believe me, I want my YouTube channel to succeed. I want to have a successful, you know, well-known YouTube channel. But not at the cost of losing so much damn money. I need um, my money for other things, too, you know. Uh, and $600, I, I, I can't afford to uh, use it on Sony Vegas. So, if there's any other thing I can do to, um, you know, improve the sound audio without spending that much money, that'd be great. If people have told me to try Audacity, but I looked it up on YouTube, and Audacity only does crap for the microphone, not sound balancing, and I don't need that. My voice is fine. It's the games that aren't, so I need sound balancing, not crap for the microphone. So, I don't know what to do. Um, just take it day by day, you know, like, there's really not that much I can do for my videos. No one's really helping me out. Um, there's this guy I know on YouTube, I mean, he's trying, he's giving me advice, but advice isn't gonna do crap if I can't do anything myself, you know? Anyway, let's see, so, Mary Jane and Ted are tired from lack of sleep, but I'm gonna save the first aid kit for when I really need it. So, everyone needs water. Okay, so Mary Jane needs water. And they both need water. So let's get them both some water. And let's see. Enough sitting around. We have to go outside. They don't want to go outside. They're, they they all... So fuck, we're, we're screwed already. Um, I don't know. We hope we can get a radio. I don't know. Um, let's see. Jane isn't worried, or at least he's not saying it out loud. Ted is trying not to worry. He's okay. So does that mean we can go scavenging? Because I need to go scavenging. Um, yeah, we need to ration for supplies. We need to- we need to- Son of a bitch, people. Why aren't you letting me go outside? Okay, maybe- maybe if we give him some soup, that'll help, and they can finally go freaking ration. Go- go on your expedition, damn it. We need the family to survive. They're not going to. Knock, knock. That sound always surprises us and confuses us. It could mean anything good or bad. But we're always curious should we open the door. Um, probably, because we have barely any supplies. So let's see what I can do. But let's see. So, okay, day five. So that's good. So yeah, like I mentioned, be oh, see, look at that. We got more water. So someone must have given us more water. I don't know. Let's see. A group of travelers were wearing gas masks and they were carrying some serious equipment. They gave us some water. That's good. Okay, so they are doing well. That's good. 
And no one is in any healthy condition to go outside. This sucks. We've been smelling something funny in the shelter ever since we woke up. Sure enough, there's something that started a fire. It's already spreading. We can't save everything. What do we save? Save the first aid kit. Save the first aid kit. That is like, do or die. Yeah. Okay, so the first aid kit is, is, is safe. And Ted is thirsty. Drugs! Get the drugs! <laughs> nice. Uh, Ted is thirsty. Mary Jane is thirsty. They're both thirsty. We're gonna run out of water because these two... Well, well, you know, I mean, we, we got a big water jug, but whatever. Um, no scavenging. This freaking sucks. Um, so for those of you who are watching this video, um, and you haven't seen my other ones, um, I've noticed 60 seconds does not get as many views as my other ones. And that's why I'm going to do this maybe about two or three more times. And then if it's still not getting a lot of views, I'm going to stop. Because, you know, I want to put content that you guys like. And if you don't like 60 seconds, then, you know, I'm going to stop doing it. Um, I hope you do. I don't know. No one's really letting me know how they feel. So I, in the comments, there's only like a few videos where that happens now so, so I really don't know if people like 60 seconds no one's letting me know if they like me playing this you know um our real occasion probably something we'll have to discuss after we have it here okay so Mary Jane is okay Ted is okay so good um and they're both being stupid so we can't go rushing for supplies uh okay some someone is very serious about banging on the hatch. We are scared to open it, but it might be something good. It might be some good news. We could gladly see. We could. Damn it! I mean, this is why I don't like reading out loud. I never did. Like you know how some stupid effing schools for like English class they make you read parts of the of the story out loud. I hate doing that crap. Um, we would gladly welcome any friendly face, even if it was our neighbor to Ned. We're pretty sure that if there was any reason for our town to be bombed, it would be him. He'd be the reason. Uh, probably. I mean, we, we need supplies, man. We need someone to give us crap. So we'll see. We'll see. I mean, it could be bandits. It could be, you know, other bad issues. But we'll see. We'll see. Oh, look at that. Dolores. She somehow survived. That's, that, that's cool. I mean, rest in peace, Timmy. But okay. <laughs> rest in peace, Timmy. We opened the door, we just laughed and screamed and screamed and laughed some more. It was Dolores. She survived the blast, or more or less without a scratch. Oh, this is a happy day. Dolores is tired. And Ted is okay. Yeah, but is, is she thirsty? Um, so yeah, I guess we're gonna have to use the medical first aid kit on uh, Dolores, because we don't want her to have the injuries for too long, because then that can make her have issues, and you know, that can start to kill off the family. No, that crap. So, rest in peace, medical kit. <laughs> or first aid kit. Um, I would like to get pancake. I want to get pancake. Oh, oh, Ted went insane. Oh, well. Um, I guess lack of sleep does that to you. Yeah, Ted has gone crazy, so... We're fucked. <laughs> uh, the family's probably not gonna last that much longer now, because I know when, uh someone goes insane, then that's pretty much it. You're, you're pretty much done. No one can go out. So yeah, we're screwed. We don't have a radio. Family's just slowly gonna die. Um, so yeah, I'm not sure if I said this, but um, if I didn't, um, <laughs> hello, fellow video game lovers, and welcome to this Let's Play. Um, I'm pretty sure I said that already, but, you know, I don't even know anymore, like, I have so many damn recording issues that sometimes I'll say something and then it doesn't get in the video, like, with, it, like, with six seconds it gets split into different parts. So, that's why if I repeat myself or something, that's because I don't know what the hell is being recorded and what's not being recorded, so, yeah. Mary Jane is rested, life is hard for all of us right now, divorce is in a good mood, and what about Ted? Is Ted okay? I don't know. Okay, so Ted tries to hide it, but it's obvious he has a lot of issues right now. He has lengthy conversations with a sock puppet. So yeah. Uh, the family's kind of screwed right now. Um, I don't know what we should do about Ted. I mean, Ted 
is kind of holding the family back. So I, I don't know. I mean, if I don't let them die, I don't know. No one can go. Oh, look, Mary Jane can go outside finally. We got a phone call. So that's good. That's probably the twins. So let's go send up Mary Jane. Go answer that damn phone call, day 11. And let's see. We answer the phone, and we can hear like he could have. It, it, damn it! See, this is why I don't like reading aloud. We could we could clearly hear a gasp of relief from the caller. They introduce themselves as a survivor from the nearby town of Hill Valley. So yeah, it's tw it's the twins. They might save us. That'd be cool. Okay, so Mary Jane needs food. Uh, Ted needs food, and the horse is thirsty. So, food, food, water. Okay, and Mary Jane, is that enough for an expedition? I don't know, I don't know. I'll, I'll wait one day and then, you know, we'll see if I can then send her out. Oh, and uh, just letting so you, you guys know, I am in the process of trying to get a pop filter. Um, I found one that's pretty cheap online, I'm going to see if I can buy it soon. So that'll help, that'll, you know, hopefully help my sound also improve. So Mary Jane's really tired, Dolores is quiet, and she's good. Ted looks like he's got one foot in the grave, he needs water, and Ted is rested. Last time I checked, that is not the face of a person that is well rested. And even me and my sleep issues, I at least know what it looks like to be well rested. You know, that you do not have dark circles under your eyes and you uh, look alert. But Ted, Ted looks too alert. Like he, like, he looks like he's on drugs or something. I don't know. So Ted is in really... Is, Ted is in good shape for a trip. I don't think so, but okay, whatever. The area is still irritated. Going the whistling right now might be unsafe. Well, fuck it. I guess we have to wait then. Yeah. Gonna have to wait. Besides, how would you know whether or not the wasteland has gotten better? Because we don't have the radio, so I don't know. Let's just leave it, those questions for, EP for now. Can we get some water? Everything is fine. Ted is fine. So we need water. Water. No, you don't need water. You don't need water. Mary J needs water. My family is dying. Uh, despite his need for a nap, Ted could try his best on the surface. You know what? Fuck it. Let's send Ted. We need supplies. The family is dying. And, and oh yeah, and that part I just skipped is the guy with the cards again. He wants to do a bet. And if you win the bet, you get more cards or something. Or you get something in return, but we don't have the cards. Uh, so Dora needs water. Mary Jane is fine. I don't know. Ted is being stupid. And Ted's behavior is disturbing. So who needs water? Let's see. Well, let me see that again. Uh, Dolores needs water. And Mary Jane is fine. Okay. So let's get her some water. No, water. Water. Okay. So yeah, this is not good. The family is like going to die. <laughs> What's the sake of time? We have an axe. Why can't I select the axe? We have an axe and we have a gun and we can't select anything. So I don't know. This game is weird. Oh, there we go. There we go. I just figured it out. Okay. okay. Let's give a crazy mentally disabled person an axe. Yeah, that, that, that's a great idea. Day 15. Um, it's always better when things are calm. Mary Jane is fine. Dolores is fine. Ted left a shelter. Okay, so we're doing good so far. Uh, hopefully I can get rescued. I've so far not gotten rescued. Day 16. Uh, as long as we're safe, we can stay down here. Can we spare some water? Mary Jane has been asking about it all day. Okay, so Mary Jane is thirsty. And we're running low on water. This is not good. And we don't have a radio. So the family is just sort of screwed, basically. We have no way to survive. Oh, uh, well. Yeah, I just cannot win this game. I don't know. I'm really good at it, I guess. Um, so Dolores, is wa Dolores needs water. I was about to say Dolores is water. 
I guess we all are, in that sense. You know, like, our bodies are, I think, like, 70 or 80% water, so we are water. <laughs> oh, God. I really hope the family lives day 18. Okay, so we're doing good. I think the longest I've played so far is up to day 40. Which is not that impressive. Like, Jay from the Cub Scouts, who also plays, plays this game, he got up to, like, day 100. So, yeah. But we need to make up today will be our tomorrow, so let's make it right. Okay, so Jane, Mary Jane, um, needs food. Okay, so Mary Jane needs food, have some soup. The family's running out of food and water, we're going to die. While Mary Jane was rummaging through our belongings, we found a single plant seed. We have no idea what kind of seed it is, but maybe it's the start of something great. If we're lucky, it might be an apple tree, or a cherry tree, or something edible. We need to use a water, a water bottle. No. I've already seen this. With Jane in the Cub Scouts. And if you do this, what happens is that the plant will grow and become radioactive. And be this like living plant monster. Kind of like a, a uh, Venus flytrap. And it will try to eat the family. So, no. I've already seen what will happen. So, so, no. That, that's just not a good idea. The plant tries to kill the family and, and you waste water, so it's just, no, not a good idea. So Mary Jane is sad, right, right. Okay, Ted has been out for too long. He still has not returned. Ted's gone, fuck it. <laughs> we, um, there are plenty of ways to use our water. Yeah, so so Ted's gone. Ted's gone. Uh, Mary Jane needs a drink. I kind of figured that was going to happen since Ted was mentally insane. But the stupid uh, journal said, oh, Ted can go outside, so... I don't know. I thought, you know, that he would come back despite being mentally insane, but oh well. So it just became an all-girls run. Just the mom and daughter. Day 20. Hopefully they live. I don't know. Hopefully they get rescued. I mean, I, I really don't know. Like, I have not gotten rescued at all. Okay, so ignorance is bliss. Another day without a clue what's going on might kill us, or necessarily might not kill us, whatever. Um, the war is needs water. What about Mary Jane? Does Mary Jane need anything? Let's see. Okay, so Mary Jane is good, okay. And no one can go outside, so we are screwed. <laughs> Oh god. I don't even know if the family's gonna survive. Like, I really don't. Well, hey, look, Mary Jane. Er, Dolores looks good. That's good. Okay, so Mary Jane is fine. Um. Dolores is rested. Okay, um. No, 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 no. What do you, they're fine. We don't need soup. Okay. Um. Dolores is confident she will survive. Yeah, Ted's freaking dead. I don't know what the hell. Either he is dead or he got captured, so who knows. Okay. An isolated, for an isolated shelter, we sure had a lot of disturbances. Something has been making a lot of noise since dawn, and we couldn't sleep. It seems to be coming from under the floor, and we coincidentally just found a manhole that we could use. Okay, so what? Uh, oh, so I can't use the gun for that? What the hell? Oh, well. Yeah, note to self, do not send Ted out ever again if he's insane. Even if the game says he can do it, he can't. The game is being stupid. And Mary Jane is now a chicken. She went insane. Uh, so yeah, the family is gonna die again. <laughs> like, uh, water, Mary Jane needs water. I don't know, like, is there any point in making them live? Like, when the family member has gone mentally insane, they're kind of useless, so... I don't know. Uh, who should go outside? Um... Okay, I guess Dolores, and then let's give her a gun. There's really not much else I can do. The family is... screwed, you know? Um... <laughs> The family's gonna die, and like, I, I'm just doing whatever I can. So, I don't know. 
we don't have a radio, so no one can really help us. Like, the radio was so essential to beat the game, and I don't have it. I couldn't get it in time. That's the thing with this game. Everything is very randomized, so there's always so much I can do. Um, so... Mary Jane is hungry. Like, there's really no point keeping her alive, but oh well. I don't know what else to do. So yeah, someone in the comments let me know if you like this playthrough. Um, if you don't, I can replace this with Sonic Adventure. So it'll be Sonic Adventure every Monday and Thursday if people do not like this. So just someone let me know in the comments and all that good stuff. So being stuck in a tiny shelter is will make everyone apathetic. I'm always apathetic. So if anything, this would make me even more apathetic. Mary Jane is thirsty. We're running out of water, running out of soup. This is not good. Uh, so... Mary Jane has an injury, and yeah, so fuck it. Mary Jane, sorry, you're gonna have to live with your wound now. And now she's sick. Yeah, you j just die, Mary Jane. <laughs> like, there's no point. There's no point. She's looking pale today? No, she's looking red. She looks like she has a fever. Or something. So yeah, fuck it. Bye, bye Mary Jane. She's gonna have to die or something. Wait, there's nothing I can really do. Day 27. You know, I noticed something about the character just now. If you look closely, you can see little outlines on her. Like, with these uh, characters, since they're just like 2D little drawings. Um, if you look really closely, you can see there are spots where they missed coloring her. So they, they just colored over uh, the little cartoon to give her the, the pinkish red skin. You can actually see just a little bit, just barely, barely, unless my eyes are fooling me. Uh, you should be able to see just barely her normal skin underneath. Unless my eyes are, my eyesight is failing me, which it shouldn't be, because I usually have a really good eye for this sort of thing. Which is why I'm really good at drawing. So we don't, if we don't cure Mary Jane, soon knows what will happen. Well, bye. Uh, there's nothing I could do, Mary Jane. Mary Jane is gonna die. The family's gonna die. <laughs> yeah, I... I don't, I don't know, like, like, that's to make this game very tricky. Everything is placed in a random area. Everything, everything is positioned randomly. So you can only get so many things in 60 seconds, you know, and... Uh, I'm not sure what the run button is, so I don't know. It's just a lot of things. Oh my, I think it's huge. And there goes another one. There's roaches everywhere. We're doomed. <laughs> okay. So Mary Jane is thirsty. I hope Dolores comes back. At least get Dolores rescued. I mean, Mary Jane can't do crap. She's just wasting water for us. Oh good, Dolores is back. And she's sick. Oh well. <laughs> yeah, the family, family, the, the family screwed. Oh well. So Mary Jane did today. What well, Mary Jane did today was a real shock to us, but no one was around. While no one was around, she started meddling with our food supply. She didn't even eat or drink anything. She just poured it in the trash. We have no idea what came over her, but we doubt she did it out of spite. She seems to not remember anything. Instead, she just keeps sniffing and sniffing. She's sniffing and giggling while staring at an empty wall. The whole situation is really weird. And the words came back. So we reached the local police station. North surprise, surprise, whatever. So they give us anything. They give us more soup, and they give us a map. Um. Okay, that's great. But we also need a radio, so we're kind of fucked. <laughs> oh, damn it! The end. Yeah, I kind of figured. So yeah, if one of the parents dies, you're screwed. So Dora's faced hunger and eating is a habit that's hard to shake off. You can take it anymore. So we died. <laughs> this sucks. Um, so yeah, um, let me know if you want me to keep doing this. Let me know if you want me to keep playing this game. Uh, no one's really telling me how they feel about 60 seconds. It's gotten the least amount of views, so I feel like people don't like it. Um, so if you don't like it, let me know and I can replace this with Sonic Adventure.
But if you do like it, let me know. And if you do like it, let me know what I can do to improve or, you know, stuff like that. Just keep in mind, I'm an extremely new YouTuber uh, for, for in terms of gaming. In terms of gaming. I've been on YouTube for years. I've been on YouTube actually since, I think, like, 2005 or 2004. Like, I was around on YouTube during the Charlie the Unicorn era and when Smosh first started out with their Pokemon video. So I've been around ever since the, the beginning of YouTube, pretty much. But my gaming channel hasn't. And that's because I suck ass with technology. So I'm in the process of getting a pop filter. I'm in the process of trying to find video game software. Video editing software, I mean. Uh, that can let me balance the audio better. So there's really not that much I can do, you know. Uh, so just let me know what I, what I can do to improve. That's still within my capabilities knowing that I suck ass with technology. And I can barely use a computer. You really need to keep that in mind. Um, so, aside from that, this is it. The family is dead. I just cannot beat this game. I cannot get the family to survive. I don't know. Um, so, we died. I don't know. It sucks. So, oh well. We perished. Yeah. So, this is Asper Gaming going away. I hope you liked the video.